There is more to APA style than just citing your sources. APA style also sets guidelines for how your paper should be formatted. In this video, we will go over what some of those pieces are and how the library can make the formatting process easier. Let's start on the library's APA guide. You will notice that we have made many resources available to you to make this easier for you, but some of our most popular resources are our APA templates. We have templates available for download for different assignment lengths, whether you need an abstract and table of contents or just a short paper. Let's look at the fill-in form to go over APA formatting. We'll start with some of the basics. All of your margins should be set to one inch. You would set this under the Page Layout tab, but with our template, this is already set up for you. You should also be using the font Times New Roman in size 12, and the space between your lines should be double-spaced. The header is an important part of your paper. The header on your first page should have the words Running Head, followed by your title in all caps, with the page number in the right corner. You can double-click to edit this. You will have a different first page from all of the pages that come after it. From your second page onward, you will have the same header but with the words Running Head removed. Let's take a look at the cover page. Toward the center of the paper in centered text, you will want to repeat the title of your paper and insert your name and your university. A little further down, you will list your course code, your instructor's name, and the date you submit your paper. That's it! In the body of your paper, you will repeat your title one more time at the top of the page and then continue on with your writing. Remember to indent each new paragraph by hitting the tab key. If you have any headings in your paper, the first level will be centered and bold, and subheadings will go to the left, like this. If you need a visual and would like to view an example of a completed paper, you can view that on the APA guide too. If you'd like to learn how to do your references page, be sure to watch our references video.